Okay. Um, I'll conclude with the board's chair report. I know time, you guys, bunch of you are close to packing up and need to go. Just a couple things. Um, I'm chairing the school fee uh, task force. We're moving forward on that. Our meetings are intense and focused and long and purposeful. Um, and we are working through quite a few issues. Of course, it's a closed meeting. Everyone's signed a confidentiality agreement to keep things that way until we have strong recommendation, until we have um, recommendations for the board and, and it's moving forward it's on schedule. Um, the OLAG audit will be coming out soon. We'll be addressing that. Um, brace yourself, be prepared because you can only, you can make assumptions based on, on our, our little, eva our little evaluation, our little audit of what will be coming that way. So I, I uh, invite you to get prepared for that a little bit. July was supposed to be a month off from a lot of meetings and, and that, and that's not true. So whoever said that, I don't know where they got it, but um, appreciate all the work that everyone was doing during the month of July. The month of July. That's when a lot of staff try to get their vacations in and different things, but it didn't pan out very well there. Um, I've heard a lot from different organizations that you guys um, have assignments that you go and meet rural schools. The list just goes on and on. Um, your participation is valued and they appreciate a real active board that shows up and is concerned and wants to make uh, good education happen and, and bring betterments uh, to that. So thank you for your service and also um, your contribution to this board. And also I want to do it, give a shout out to your families. Um, you know, the summer's over, a lot of vacations. We're trying to s s get schools in, but they they uh, deal with the your absence um, a lot because I know you guys are scheduled. I know what you guys are, are doing and where you're going and so if you could ex extend a, a thank you that way um, from the leadership, we appreciate that. I wanna recognize the leadership that we've been doing a lot of divide and conquering as we've been dealing with issues and um, people have stepped up, including the chairs and everyone else to uh, take care of business here. Um, I'm, I'm quickly going through this because I know you guys wanna, wanna go. Um, a lot of the staff have left, and I'm, I'm, I'm not here to sell the staff to you because I don't think they, that life is based on results. And we have really good staff, and I want to speak to the staff a little bit because I rub shoulders with them. I don't direct them, but, not, but as the chair, I'm in meetings and I see what's going on. I check with the superintendent C to make sure things are moving. I work with our AAGs, make sure what's happening is happening. The chair is not directing anything, but I can say from my observation that they are working for the board and they're doing their very best to serve this board. And you are, I'll throw this out there, you are heard and you are relevant and your contribution uh, is noted to staff. So thank you if you can pass that, pass that on. Um, there's a lot of work that happens here, and we're a little bit ahead of the curve, I believe, than where we've been in the past. And, and a lot of that has to do with leadership um, and also what the, the way this board is communicating um, to our superintendents, uh, our superintendency, I should say. So thank you, thank you for that, if you can pass that on. But then I wanna to speak to you guys directly. As a chair, you know, sometimes things get kind of chaotic and some people may question what's on the agenda. You are relevant to me and you are important and your thoughts, whatever you, whatever it is that you're trying to do to bring good education to the state of Utah is, is important to me. I may not agree with everything, but you will have an opportunity. You will be heard. Um, that we're still moving forward with things are being fair and reasonable and having um, a good regard for each other and that, and, and I think that still exists today. If it isn't, then I want to hear about it um, because that's how, that's how I'm wanting to chair and, and listen, to, listen to you. So if you think you're not being heard, I need to know about it. Um, 
So thank, I want to give a thank you for me personally um, for the good work that you're doing. And we have some interesting discussions. Um, but that's what we, some people might refer to us as a diverse board. I think when you have 15, a 15-member 15 board, you are always going to have diversity. So that is, that is welcome. And maybe not on every issue you'll win. Um, if you're trying to keep a score a scorecard on that, but what you your contribution and the discussion is relevant. So th thank you for bringing that. So thank you for your service and be safe. Tomorrow it'd be nice if we can all start on time. So if we can get here on time, that'd be really good. I think the chair will be based. Do you have any questions for me? Okay. If you do, feel free to. To, to give that shout out. I think that concludes all of our business for today. Ms. Lorraine, is that correct? Okay. We'll seek a motion to adjourn. We got seconds and all that in favor, so we're good to go. Thank you.